is Danny with Novels Alive, and today I have New York Times best-selling author Jacqueline Frank, and you look so different now. I do. Thank you. <laughs> you lost a couple of pounds. Yeah, one or two. What? One or two. And One hundred and eighty. Fabulous. <laughs> you look absolutely you. wonderful, unrecognizable to some. Yeah. Yeah, you should see, uh, I still have my old license picture in the TSA. Whenever I get on the airplane, they're like, huh. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's you. So, yeah. And you are quite the author. You've got quite you. a series going on and a new book coming out in July. I do. I in do. a series. Uh, I, yeah, it's actually my new series is the Three World series. Uh-huh. Um, it's kind of a cross, it's a sci-fi, Navy SEAL, paranormal kind of oh. blend. All of the good stuff. Yeah, I and did. What? I picked all my favorites. Oh, I get my Navy, that Navy, my Navy SEAL, um, uh, um, Alpha male. Lost. <laughs> that whole thing comes from Suzanne Brockman, who I'm oh, actually, yeah. I'm actually going to end, uh, New Jersey RWA, and she's the keynote speaker, and I'm secondary. Oh, fun. When they asked me, I said, can I touch her? Just a little bit, they're like, well, you could sit next to her. And I'm like, okay, that's enough. Thanks, guys. That's good. That's good enough. <laughs> so, does she know that she inspired you? Probably not. Well, I but she, she will <laughs> at the end of the the end of the conference. Absolutely, and how fun for you to be to be able to tell her that. And I'm sure, haven't you ever had aspiring authors say you inspired me? Um, yeah, I have. I have. I and and I pretty much. Well, it's and there, and there's a mixture of, of of how that approach goes. Some of them go pretty much probably the way I approached Christine Feehan, where Christine Feehan stops going like this. <laughs> <laughs> you know, she, has, she has that smile and she's like, how is this person? Because I'm all like, oh my God, I love your book. <laughs> you know, so I'm just as bad as every other reader <laughs> in the, in, on the planet. Well, because so. you're a reader and a writer, so it's well, okay. Well, you know, I feel like you have to you have to read your genre in, in order to write your genre. I, I really do, in, or, or to stay on top of it. I mean, mm -hmm. I'm, and 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 then it's really funny is because the sad thing about that is since I got published, I haven't been able to read a damn thing because I don't have any time. I, I understand how that works. <laughs> so and then I and, and then I hear all. These really great ideas. I'm like, yeah, why don't I think about that? Oh, why don't I think about that? So, but what sets your apart, yours apart, is that you've got this Navy SEAL influence. Oh well, well, this kind of, is, well, I mean, they're not Navy. This is my demons. Right? This is my oh, Nightwalker the series. Okay. The I have I have um, the the uh, three world series okay. with the Navy. The, with, not Navy SEALs because they're on a totally different planet. So they're they're, they're 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 called the ETF, the Extreme Tactics Tactics Force. And um, but they're very Navy Seal ish. ish. You, could, okay. you could you could just feel it. They are soldiers. It's what that all the information I ever got about like was super soldiers. I got from Christine Seahans and Ghost Walkers, oh. and I got from Suzanne Brockman. So I got a lot of that the, that feel, and and I hope I captured it and and played it. We played it, but we played it. The new book in the old series. Yeah, the old Actually, book. I okay. had decided the uh, night. I had ended the Nightwalker series with five books, okay. and unfortunately, I had not. I had written all five of them before I was even published. Oh, for the first wow. one. So yeah, which believe me, when my my editor found me, she was and, and she got my first. She just got the first book. She's like, I love this. I can see the future. I can see <laughs> Noah being the second book. I go, well, actually. <laughs> I think Gideon's going to be the second book. And she goes, oh, that's a great idea. I go, well, <laughs> actually, I kind of wrote it already. She's like, well, can I see it? I'm like, sure. So I, 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 I like, I, great. And she goes, so who are you thinking for the third book? I said, well, kind of Elijah. And she's like, really? What are we going to do with him? And I go, well, I actually kind of wrote that one already. She goes, really? Oh, like, my yeah. word. It's like, I actually wrote five of them already. She's like, you need an agent. Because I'm going to take really big advantage of you. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get an agent. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> So she got me, helped me get my agent, and that the rest is wonderful history. luck. So I had actually written all five, and I decided to end with five because by that point I'm the kind of a writer where I'm like, I've been there, done that, whatever, you know. And I didn't take into consideration that I had left this one big hanging thread. Oh. I had not. I, 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 I'm the kind of person who think that, thinks that it should have, it, you don't always get everything you want in life, and, and so I didn't, I thought, you know, so what, you know, Ruth, the bad guy, she doesn't get killed in the end, oh, I, I won't, I'm not going to do the pat ending, I can't stand, pat endings, you can't, if you anticipate me, I cry, I just don't want you to be able to do any of that, I do things because I want you all to go, she can't do that. I can't. I'm not going to happen. So, 
But after two, three years now, everybody's going, what about Ruth? You can't end it without doing something to her. She has to die. So that's what this is about. That's where Adam comes in. Okay. And this is never before seen cover. And my party will be debuting, which is tomorrow. Excellent. And um, he is the long lost brother of a certain demon everybody knows and loves and and it's all about him and it's all about what happens to Ruth. She gets her comeuppance I hope. She gets her comeuppance. The question is how do I go about it? So I'm not going to say And you'll have to read the book to find out. You have to read the book because I am not telling. And when does it come out? This will be out in November of 2011. That's this year. So hurry and read the five books before. Yes, so it's Jacob, Gideon, Elijah, Damien, and Noah. And then you don't have to wait very long for the sixth book. And then Adam yes. comes Now, out. everybody else has been waiting three years. Yeah. Okay. So now, <laughs> this is, um, so so you get to get it instantaneously. <laughs> you read it right before. You don't have to go through the, what about me? The whole angst of waiting. <laughs> well, thank you so much. I sure appreciate you coming oh, today. No problem. No problem. I thank you for having me. <laughs>